What's up guys, welcome back to another Real Madrid preview video. Um, of course, the game, the new season actually, is starting soon. And we're gonna get back to these videos, we're gonna be, we're gonna be using FIFA as like the lineup prediction, kind of, you know, just for a bit of spice, for a bit of fun as well. Of course, you guys might be wondering and saying, it's a, it's only a preseason game, it's a friendly game, whatever, it doesn't matter. But, pre but because it is a friendly, it is a preseason game, whatever, it is very important because, let's say, Ludin, he might play, he's gonna play p potentially, right? Um, let's say he gets to his best form during preseason, he can play better during the actual season. Um, so, we need to take, you know, we need to look at that as well. It, it helps boost morale and the, the manager knows what kind of tactics, what kind of style, what kind of players, and all, what kind of formation, what, what's the best? Um, so let's start with the squad. We start with the goalkeeper. For me, it's going to be Ludin actually. He's going to play for me. Um, I just see him playing. And I've, I've said this before. I've said it again. I want to see Ludin play. We want to see him play. We want to see him at the best. Right? He still has a lot to offer. Left back is going to be Marcelo. Um, Mandy is not fit. He has been training with the team, with the club. Um, why did I say club there? It should be with the team actually. He has been training with the team but pretty much alone um, in the gym as well um, because he's not 100% fit so he trades alone and he's not going to be able to play the entire I think against Bidan too and yeah um, he might not even be able to play the first two match days. Um, first in the back is going to be a current Real Madrid player in FIFA, Nacho for me anyways. I feel like he's going to get a lot of of game time this season, especially with the likes of Ramos leaving and Varane close to leaving as well. For me, Nacho Fernandez is going to be as one of the centre backs. Then I, I think we're gonna go with Jesus Vallejo here, right? You guys might be wondering, lol, 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 why are you thinking we are gonna play with Jesus Vallejo? Of course, with the departure of Ramos, the centre back is quite thin. Varane, he's training with the team. Um, at the time of recording, he is training with the with the team, with the squad, but I, I just think he's gonna leave um, there as well. And for me, right, Vallejo, and the club have said it before, that Vallejo is the replacement to Ramos and Varane. He's coming in, we're not gonna buy any centre backs. We're not gonna buy anyone. So, yeah, we're not gonna buy anyone. So, Vallejo for me is gonna get pretty much quite a bit of game time this season. Um, and of course, Alaba will not be making his debut against Rangers. He'll be playing against Milan. Then we've got Lucas Vasquez at the right back spot as well. I feel like he's going to be challenging with Carvajal for the right back spot. He's been absolutely brilliant last season. He was brilliant last season as well. Um, and I just think he's going to put on a good fight as well. He looks absolutely top tier, top class, mate. He's going to be very crucial at that right back spot. And it's just that he doesn't have any. I guess spot, I, I, um, so to speak, in that front tree for him to play. Um, one of the midfielders next I've got is Martin Erdegaard. Let me just go and find Martin Erdegaard. For me, he's going to be a very crucial player in there, in down the middle as well. You know, very, very crucial. Doing that, actually, I'm going to put him there. Doesn't really matter, but we're just going to put him in there. In that midfield role, I just think that we're going to play Luka Modric. I just think Luka Modric is going to play again. Of course, he did very well in Croatia. And he's back to training, of course. Uh, so, next to him, I was debating between Cruz and Isco. And I'm going to go with Isco. Um, I just think that him under Ancelotti is going to get more games. Like, even though I don't really want that to happen. And it's not like I hate Isco or anything like that. It's just that I just don't see him being at the top of his game. It doesn't matter. Yeah. I just don't see him being that good anymore, to be fair. I just don't think he's going to get back to his best. He might prove me wrong at the end of the season, but he might not. Left-hand side, who are we going to go with? Of course, Asensio is with um, Spain in the Olympics. Hazard is still not back yet. Vinicius is not back yet. So, options are limited. Um, let me just move it here. First thing, I think we're going to go with Rodrigo. Though, um, Rodrigo, essentially for me, is going to be the player that we play down that left at all, maybe even the right. To be fair, I don't know, man. Do I, would I want to say Bell? 
is the question. For me, if I was to say for Hugo to turn the left, it was going to be fail on the right, right? Um, which you know what? I I, I think Ashton is gonna play Bell. Yeah, why not? Just let Bell in. Why not, right? I feel like Bell is gonna play. You know, um, and up front for me, who are we gonna go with? Benzema, she's still on vacation. I don't think he'll be able to play. Mariano or Jovic? Bro, it, it's it's not as if I care. But for the, for, for the sake of in real life, I'm going to go with Jovic. Right? Jovic. And I really think that we need a better attacker, a better striker, you know. Mbappe. Operation Mbappe. Come on. Come on the club. Come on. Let's get Mbappe. You know you want to. We actually do want to. Anyways, let me, um, this is going to be the team I think we use, or I, I haven't bought Ancelotti back yet for this account, so I don't have Ancelotti with me, I don't want to go and spend, I don't want to go and buy right now, I will go get him, and yeah, he'll be in other Real Madrid preview games. Let me know what you guys think of this lineup, what would your lineup be as well, um, let's just be in the bench, to be honest, do I care about the bench, do I bother about the bench, maybe, maybe not. Actually, I don't. I actually don't. But I want to. You know what I mean? I don't want to care, but I want to care. Um, I, I just think Mariano might get onto the bench. Um, I just put out tubing as well, because why not? A backup goalie, I guess, is the on the bench, sitting on the bench, chilling. Zola, maybe he can be on the bench as well. Who else would be on the bench for this game? I'm trying to think, because... I don't, I don't know when these players are coming back. Uh, I, I can't think. I can't think. I genuinely can't think. Right. By the time the, the game plays, the game starts, right, we would probably have Cruz back. And, yeah, I, 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 would, I would actually predict Cruz will come back. Um, hmm. You know what? Let's go with a bit of. I'm delaying. I'm delaying the time right now. Let's put Tony Cruz on the bench. Let's put Carvajal on the bench. Um, there you go. Tony Cruz, Carvajal as well. The new ninety five year old from Senka. And who else do I think will be on the bench? We currently have five spots. We need two more spots. Hmm. Let's go with Eden Hazard. He has got way better cut. Why am I putting this one in? Yeah, I think Hazard will be on the bench. Or, or maybe not. Maybe he'll play. Maybe he'll be on the bench. Who knows? And the last one, let's just put in... Let's put in... Um, I, I don't know who is back, who is not back. Yeah, let's just randomly put one dude in for fun. But I'll put in Casemiro for now. I, I don't know whether he's back or not. So this for me will be the team. Let me know what you guys think about this lineup, of course. What you guys would go to the lineup, you can write it down in the comment section below. Of course, um, my links to my main channel, to my Twitch channel, um, my Twitter, and all are down below as well. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video though. Hit the like button if you guys did. Subscribe to the channel if you guys aren't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.